The T-80 U main battle tank is a further development of the T-80. It entered service with the Soviet Army in 1985. Currently this main battle tank and different variants is in service with Russia, China, Cyprus, Pakistan, and South Korea. Production of T-80 series main battle tanks ceased in Russia in 1992, however its development and production continued in Ukraine. Due to expensive maintenance Russian army plans to retire all T-80 series tanks. This machine has a welded hull and cast turret. Armor of this MBT was improved comparing with the previous version. It features composite armor and is fitted with built-in contact 5 air blocks. It is estimated that armor protection of the T-80U is equal to 900 mm against heat rounds and 1100 mm against projectiles. This main battle tank is also fitted with automatic fire suppression and NBC protection systems. The T-80U is armed with a fully stabilized 125 mm smoothbore gun, fitted with an autoloader. It fires APDS, TEAT and high explosive frag rounds. Effective range of fire with APF SDS round is 2000-3000 meter. Armor penetration is about 590 to 630 millimeters at 2000 meter range. The tank can also launch 9M119M Reflex Western reporting name AT-11 Sniper B anti-tank guided missiles in the same manner as ordinary projectiles. These missiles have a maximum range of 5 km and can target low-flying helicopters. The missiles use a semi-automatic laser guidance and have a hit probability of 80% at 4000 meter range and 70% at 5000 meter range. Maximum rate of fire is 6 to 8 rounds per minute. Secondary armament consists of 7.62 mm coaxial machine gun and 12.7 mm machine gun, mounted on top of the roof. The tank has one A46 fire control system includes a laser range finder, a ballistic computer, and a more advanced 1G46 gunner's main sights, as well as thermal imaging sights, which greatly increases the T-80U firepower over previous models. These new systems, together with the 125mm D81TM Rapier 3 smoothbore gun, ensure that the T-80U can accurately hit and destroy targets at a range of up to 5 km. T-80 UMBT was originally produced with a GTD 1000 TF gas turbine engine, developing 1100 horsepower. Tanks produced in the early 1990s were fitted with a more powerful GTD 1250 gas turbine engine, developing 1250 horsepower. It is a multi-fuel engine, which can run on kerosene, diesel, and petrol or aviation fuel. It has servicing intervals significantly longer than of diesel engines, however is troublesome to maintain and has very high fuel consumption comparing with diesels. This engine can be replaced in field conditions within 3 hours. The tank is also equipped with auxiliary power unit, which powers main systems when the tank is stationary. T-80 were intended to be retired by 2015 but delays in T-14 program led to upgrade program for T-80 UE-1. Further T-90 tank has also T-80 turret on T-72 chassis. Modernization would likely replace the older Plesa thermals on the UE-1 with the new Sosna U. Similar modernizations would probably be easily applied to the regular T-80 U and T-80 UA that are still in service. T-80 is a potent platform in modern battlefield as some may say. Reports of the T-80S obsoleteness are greatly exaggerated, 